we just got to Osaka. We're staying in the Nikonbashi area, so you know us. We're heading out to a market first thing. You hungry? Yep. I'm always hungry. Let's get some food. Kobe beef skewer right next to Kobe Japan, so it can't get any more real than that. Arigato. Oh, it's really good. It melts in your mouth. Yum. That's really good. That's almost as good as the beef that your dad raises. Almost. Almost. And that's only one block from our, our room. That could be dangerous. Oh, it's really good. This whole country is just packed with wow on the food front. Wasabi! Holy cow! Look at the size of that sushi roll. The place down here is serving cow lungs. Cow lungs. Plan in Osaka other than just wandering around. It's working out pretty good. Cool city. Halloween store. Uh, For all the silence of the rest of Japan, the pachinko parlor. Holy crap! Sticking with one of our themes of trying tacos all over the world, Kate found. The only taco bar in Osaka, called Osaka Tacos. Osakos. We'll soon find out how good they are. Cool atmosphere. I like the music. The microwave nachos are here. The atomic blonde is here. Osaka taco was very unique. Yeah, it was like a fried bread, which was really good. A unique take on tacos and was really good. Yeah, nachos, yeah. skip them. And the salsa was really good. The homemade salsa was oh, good. It was yeah. sweet. Thumbs up for Osaka tacos. Look at his eyebrows. Just wandering around the back streets of Osaka, still. Catch your own fish out of their pot. <laughs> they got crab and everything in there. It's awesome. Birthday's on the road. Happy birthday, dear Iris. Happy birthday to you. Today we're gonna go through Dontonburi, right along the river. It's supposed to be great food and shopping and food. Food. There are so many interesting kind of animatronics and little like robots and stuff around here. It's really neat. I found Waldo! Trying to convince Kate she needs to try this, the Gyoza hot dog. Hey, if it wasn't $10, I'd be willing to try it. <laughs> committing to shopping today. We're going in there. What, where, where's she going? Every country, I have to try the Big Mac. So far, they've been pretty good. Beijing was absolutely horrible. So we're gonna see. Japan seems to do things quite well. Good. Not the best, but good. Where's the best? Actually, it was China. You just said Beijing was terrible. Oh, sorry. 
not Beijing. Start with a B. Bangkok. <laughs> well, thank you for alienating two countries. <laughs> no, China was the best. Bangkok was the worst. Well, thankfully we don't have to go to McDonald's in Bangkok. <laughs> oh yeah, and we got a sweet potato milkshake. How's that? Oh, that's surprisingly good. It's very sweet. I would not have taken it as sweet potato. But it's really good. Very sweet. Sickening sweet. And it continues. It's raining. Looks like our last day in Japan is going to be us working our way back to the hotel to chill out for a bit because our hotel is really comfortable. We are trying to order by kiosk. <laughs> I have numbers. Give your ticket to your server and off they go. And out it comes. Ginger pork. Oh wow, they're really good. I like the ginger in it. it, has a sweetness to it. Very good. Much too soon our time in Japan is over. It was a lot of fun. This country is amazing. I would love to stay here for a much longer time, but we do not have the budget to stay here for another minute. So. We are, I don't know why I'm laughing, that's, that's actually true. But definitely love to come back here. Yes, absolutely. Our next stop is Seoul, South Korea. Goodbye, Japan, thanks. If you like our video, leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good.